Hey you, watching this video, spread love and subscribe to my daddy's channel. Do it! Bienvenidos and welcome back, familia. Today we continue our journey exploring the wonderful music of Hillsong United with their album, Are We There Yet? If you all are ready to go, grab your headphones and let's do this. It's not sounding like a church bell in the back. Oh. Oh, nice. A lot of bass. I love this transition here. Wh whose voice is this, by the way? I'm not familiar with this voice, but I, I like it. Nice and soft, emotional. I like it. I like it so far. This could possibly be Ocean's number two. In the lyrics, we're hearing sort of the same thing, right? Be, be taken deeper. It's asking God to take us beyond our comfort zone, beyond the known and into the unknown. I like this. Love what the music is doing. Love it. I'm desperate to know the grace beyond these shores. Teach my soul not to fear the darkness. Oh, okay. Teach my heart to fully lean on your cross for comfort. Wow. Ooh. Sounds like something dropped out, like the bass dropped out there in the middle. Let's see. Beautiful transition. I love this little pre chorus here. My strength is in your name. My strength is in your name, right? Because there's nothing more powerful than the name of Jesus, right? Right? The song paints a beautiful image here. It says, your blood is in my veins, which means what? Blood is life. And it's not my life, but your life that is coursing through my veins, which means that my actions are in alignment with you, which means that my life is in alignment with you because my heart is in alignment with you. It's pumping blood into my body and that blood that it's pumping it's your blood what i love about this last verse is that it's saying i don't have power on my own and and besides even if i did have power of my own it is nothing compared to the power of god and what the song is saying is that if i have strength that strength is in your name you are my strength christ is my strength i love it Love that kick. Oh, bass came in beautifully there. His love will never fail, Pamela. You already know how we do it, familia. I say, lead me to blank. Fill in that blank. Where do you want God to lead you to? Oh, 
I love this. Ooh, kick. It's so good. Wow. <laughs> Super catchy. We were asking to leave the safety of our familiar familiarity. I love it. I love this melody, it's perfect. This is a song, again, about complete surrender and saying, lead me to whatever you want. As long as it leads into your heart. I love it. Beautiful stars there. <laughs> These guitars are like little stars. Beautiful. Wow. It keeps going. Yes, fantastic. I love this. Love, 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 love it. Familia, I really needed to hear this song today. This message was speaking directly to me because I have a confession to make. I've been really stupid lately. Lately, I've been in my worry. Lately, I've been in my frustration. Lately, I've been in my negativity, in my head, just beating myself up about the way that I feel, about the way that things are going, about the daily issues, about just about so much. Just been beating myself up in my head and wondering where God is in all of this. And this song is a beautiful reminder that he, he's here. He's here, present now, in this moment, in my issues, in my negativity, in my self-doubt in my self-criticism he, he's he's there and i call myself stupid because he his message throughout my entire life has been i'm here i'm with you and i get so caught up in the distractions of my everyday life that i completely forget that he's here he's with me he's he's currently walking with me in everything that i do and i know that many of you can relate to this you are close to God, you feel God's presence in everything that you do, but every once in a while, something goes bad. Maybe you're not eating well, maybe you're not sleeping well, maybe your work is just consuming you to the point where you completely take your eyes off of him. This song is a beautiful reminder to surrender and to allow God to lead you into his heart, lead you back home. A reminder that God is constantly calling you, constantly calling you to him, but it's you. 
who is distracted by the world. It's you who is afraid to step outside of your comfort zone. And the song is saying, God, please take me out of my comfort zone and lead me to where your grace is beyond my comfort zone. But the most important message here is lead me, lead me. I have to be more conscientious that God is always leading me. He's always leading. He's a perfect leader. The problem is that I don't always move, which is exactly why I say I'm not just a follower. I'm a student. I'm learning. I'm taking notes. I'm watching him. I'm allowing him to lead me. I'm not just listening to the words and absorbing the words. I'm putting them into action. I'm putting them into play. I love the song, and I'm definitely going to listen to the song multiple times tonight to really let the message sink in. Sophie, thank you once again for your donation. Thank you to all these beautiful people here for supporting the channel. Familia, thank you for allowing yourself to be led by the Spirit. Please remember to continue spreading the love that comes from above, and I'll see you on our next adventure. Peace. Bye.